Oh my god. Alrighty, hello everybody. Welcome to this video. Today, I you. I you. I'm very excited. Uh, we have three music videos. Gully has been busy. <laughs> busy with this uh comeback we have three music videos um to check out that have dropped over the course of the last like few weeks um and i'm i'm real excited i know a lot of people have been asking about my reaction to love wins all i've been specifically waiting because i wanted to check it out um you know well, I thought there was only going to be one more music video, and I was like, okay, I'll wait until that drops so I can check them out together. Turns out there was another one. So <laughs> we've just saved it all up, and we're doing all three at once, and it's going to be a good time. Um, so yeah, so we have Love Wins All, we have Hoshi, and Shopper um, to watch. All pretty long music videos. I am so ready for that. Uh, I will say I'm a little bit terrified for Love Wins All, just because although I haven't been super spoiled as to like what exactly happens, I do know that there is some like, um, it's a bit emotional. <laughs> That's kind of the general vibe that I've gotten and I'm like, what am I in for? But it's fine. It'll be fine. Let's get into it. Okay, so this has come with a mini album. Um... So we've obviously got the three tracks here and then there's two additional tracks. I normally don't do like album listens if there's only like two extra tracks just because I don't really know why. <laughs> I don't really know why, but it's a thing. Um, but I am going to make an exception this time uh, and I will be checking out those two other tracks over on Patreon later today. So if you're interested in my thoughts on those, feel free to hop on over. Um, but no worries if not. Let's get into these music videos so we're starting off with love wins all like i said i believe this came out it's been out for a minute <laughs> is what i'm trying to say it's been out for a minute uh and i'm quite impressed that i've managed to evade basically any and all spoilers for it um obviously i know that uh v is involved i know that he's here we love to see it um and like i said i've heard that it is a little bit emotional um but that's about it that's all i know I don't even know what the song sounds like, so let's just dive in. Oh, also, because there are three music videos and they're quite long, I will be pausing as we watch through these because um, I don't have the time to do full rewatches or anything like that. Okay, cool. We good? We good? Okay, cool. Are you? Love wins all. Three, two, one, go. Oh! oh. Don't make a joke about the blue box company. Don't make a joke about the blue box company. You guys have been beaten up. got instant chills the second the vocal started just then. like wow i wasn't ready for that Oh. 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 Oh.
Are you speaking in sign language? Oh my god. <clears throat> oh my god. Oh. It doesn't happen very often, but sometimes. Very, 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 very occasionally. Um, I will react to something that is so beautiful that I do not feel in any way like qualified or justified or anything like that to make any kind of commentary on it. <laughs> and this is one of those situations, like I feel like Anything that I say in commentary on this just will not do it justice. That song was... I don't even know what words are appropriate to use here, but it was just everything. Um, and that, yeah, that music video was... Wow. From what I could gather so she or at least she i don't know if it's both of them but at least she is deaf it looked like she was speaking in sign language um and he i'm assuming is blind in that one eye the one eye that's clouded over so i'm guessing at the end there she purposefully covered his you know, his seeing eye so that he wouldn't have to watch what was happening to them. 
That's gonna make me cry. We're gonna have to move on in a minute because I, I just, like, I don't have the words. But one thing that I do want to say that just, like, my little creative writing brain went ping, 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 uh, and really, really loved this when they first see the pile of clothes. There's a literary device, principle, idea, whatever you want to call it, um, called Chekhov's gun. <clears throat> The idea is basically that everything at the beginning of a story uh, is important. Like every detail is important. And if it's not important, then it shouldn't be there. Um, even if when you're watching it, it may seem totally like innocuous, might not seem to have any meaning or weight, inevitably there'll be some moment later on where it will have meaning. And this this is such a great example of that to me because watching it initially obviously just like the idea of them being an apocalyptic in an apocalyptic setting where there's just this mountain of clothes like that's an emotive uh sight right because it makes you think of like wow all of these people must have passed on like there's so much loss here you know they must have been really fighting and struggling to um to avoid you know avoid this but i didn't really think beyond that like why is it that they're all in this mountain in this pile of clothes like what is what's, what's going on here and then that shot at the end oh, the emotional gut punch that that has is actually insane to me. Whoever came up with this story, whoever storyboarded it, came up with this imagery, all of that sort of stuff, just well fucking done. That is, that is a beautiful story. That's like, that's how you tell a short story, man. Like that's, that's, that's how you do it. Short story, short film, whatever you get it. Like that's, that's, that's how it's done. <laughs> That was stunning. Also, I want to give up for their acting, but no one is even slightly surprised. It's, yeah. Wow. Love that that's the most replayed bit. That's really cute. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, right. That's going to haunt me. That's going to haunt me, but we need to move on. Why do I get the feeling this is going to be such a different vibe? <laughs> such a different energy. <laughs> it might be what I need, though. Just like give me like a little pick me up because I'm like emotionally destroyed right now but in the best way ugh anyway okay all right let's do it oh she let's go three two one go Ah, fluffy. Wow. Hey, hey. gorgeous that is gorgeous but is that what hoji means is that like dandelion seed like one of those little things on a dandelion is that what that means okay cool well this is beautiful wow Oh, this is so trippy. Oh, 
wanna fly 난날 보수있게 날아줄게 한가운데 시력을 위해 꼭 추천맨 선글라스 올려보면 눈부셔 고소공포 하나 또 yeah, sometimes I forget. Don't ask me why. Because I do not know, but sometimes I forget just how great her music is. It's not like I start thinking that her music is bad. It's not it's not like that at all. Please do not misunderstand. It's just like I don't know, I just get so wrapped up in other artists' music that I I don't know, I just don't think about it. And then I listen to new music and I'm like, God damn, I use music is so fucking good. Like, what? <laughs> it's like I don't know. It just it just hits me all over again. It's it's a really cool feeling, but it's also like <laughs> just remember. <laughs> mm. I love this pre-chorus. This pre-chorus is stunning. <laughs> oh, cute! You better dance, kiddos! This is one of those moments where you're just like, oh, are you as really small? <laughs> Like, she's really not that much taller than these kids. <laughs> the... The wibbly wobbly effect is tripping me out. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about it. <laughs> <laughs> is that the is that how it ends is that how the song ends that is a great line to end a song on hang on are you kidding that is Make such I'll a be with ya. See, see ya. <laughs> Make I'll be with ya. See, see ya. That is such a great line to end the song on. Are you kidding? <clears throat> Lyrics by you. We love to see it. Oh, that was, yeah, that was a great time. Oh, it's following me, sweetie. <laughs> That's a really cool shot, actually. Wow. <sighs> okay. All right. I'm just going to let it play on to shop up, but. That was it once amazing. Was a shop. Once was a shop. Okay. We and have another movie. It wasn't just any shop. It was, in fact, extraordinary, with even more extraordinary items that never seemed to run out. They say the items had powers that would only unlock to their rightful owners. Amazing concept. So Love it already. Wondering who put those items there. Was it a god? A fairy? Or maybe a thief? Our story begins here. At the midnight auction. Oh, 
Oh, I got some goosebumps already. This song. Oh, the, the drums are greatest. Is she holding him hostage with the lollipop? Iconic. Oh, this song. Oh my god. Also, am I tripping? Is this Ian? <laughs> I've been really, not gonna lie, super focused on the song and just really having a good time with the song and like loosely paying attention to what's happening in the music video. Is this Ian? I feel like I don't know him well enough to be able to say with certainty, but I also feel like it is. <laughs> I don't know. Help me out. If it is, that's fucking cool and I love it. <laughs> oh yeah, no, it definitely is. Right? This is so cool and this song is so good! It's so like, epic and cinematic and cool and I love it. Oh, I got goosebumps. Oh. <laughs> Buddy, you good? Oh, she's sick. Oh, wait. No, I don't want it to end. No. Oh. <laughs> It is him! So I'm guessing that's him doing the, uh... The voiceover. say to that i don't know what to say to any of this like this is just she's just there is very much a reason why she is so overwhelmingly beloved 
by the South Korean general public. <laughs> like, there is a reason for it. There is a reason why she is the female soloist coming out of South Korea. There is a reason why she is so dominant and so... Just just captivating like there is a reason and it's because whatever she touches whatever she does just turns into a masterpiece whether it's her music whether it's the mvs themselves whether it's her acting like she just has a midas touch when it comes to her creative endeavors and it is it's honestly just an honor to be able to sit here and witness it. It is an honor to do that. I am honored. Thank you. Thank you, Ayu, for everything. Because you... It's going to sound really dramatic, but it's almost like watching... Watching these music videos, listening to these songs. And even like... Going back to when I watched like Horo da Luna and stuff like that, like... It makes me remember why I love being creative, why I love art in all of its many facets and forms, why it is so important to encourage creativity and expressions of creativity. Like it reminds me of that. It reminds me of how much I love that and how important that is to me. And that's like that's a that's a big thing. That's an impressive thing for one one performer to be able to do that but like she just has this this expressiveness the way she just expresses herself creatively it's just so inspiring man it's so inspiring to me and i love it i love it a great deal all three of those songs masterpieces all three of those music videos masterpieces are you herself masterpiece masterpiece are you kidding wow god it does not feel like i've been sat here for like 30 minutes um <laughs> feels like i've been here for 10 but that doesn't make sense mathematically so you know um yeah <clears throat> big fan i don't even know which one's my favorite like it's actually really really difficult i think it's it's between shopper and love wins all hosi is is definitely is, is definitely up there as well i just i yeah i don't know i don't know which was my favorite they're all incredible and they're all amazing in their own way and yeah <laughs> we're just gonna leave it at that but anyway <clears throat> i'm gonna end this one here now because i need to go and process everything that i just watched um like i said i'll be checking out the remaining two tracks on the album over on patreon later today so if you're interested in seeing my thoughts on those feel free to hop on over if not no worries it's all good there are a bunch of other iu album lessons over there i haven't done her whole discography by any means but i have done you know a chunk um so if you're interested that's over there i would like to get to some more albums at some point eventually but i don't know when that's going to happen but yeah anyway i'm gonna go thank you guys very much for watching let me know your thoughts and feelings on everything and I will catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.